I'm divorced. Can y'all give it up for me? Yeah. I feel like Martin Luther King. Free at last, free at last. Thank God Almighty, I am free at last. When you get married, things change, don't they, ladies? Things change so drastically. When I was dating this man, I got the most lovely gifts. I'm talking bracelets, necklaces, you know, Victoria's Secrets. I got married, the gifts changed completely. I started getting dust busters and crock pots and serving knives on Christmas. He gonna come in the room on Christmas after giving me a crock pot and ask for some Christmas loving. Like every celebration is a time to have sex. He wants sex on his birthday, 4th of July, St. Patrick's Day, any day just to have some. It's crazy. So he came in there talking about some Christmas love on Christmas after I done got this crock pot. I said, hell no. Not after getting a crock pot for Christmas. He's like, well, what am I supposed to do with all of this? I was like, put it in the crock pot. <laughs> Shoot, I don't care. And this is ridiculous, too. The kids was even getting involved, y'all. Kids be knocking at the door. Mama, can you just give Daddy some, please? <laughs> it's a school night. He got every light in the house on. Neighbors calling from across the street. Everything all right over there? It's three o'clock in the morning. Why do y'all do that? We could be sick. Y'all, I had a fever of 103. He said, it's gonna be some hot stuff tonight. <laughs> it's crazy. But living in LA has been a, a, quite an experience for me because I'm a country girl. Any Southern women in here? Down South? Y'all don't know nothing what I'm talking about then. It's country down there. No mass transportation, taxi cabs closed at six o'clock. So <laughs> it was an adjustment for me moving to LA, right? I'll just be walking, mind my own business, and people would break out running, right? So I would run too, right? I didn't know they was running after the bus. It was quite embarrassing. <laughs> and I did it a lot, because you know, I watched the movie New Jack City, you know, Gang Bang and all like that. <laughs> So I was nervous, you know, Crips in the Bloods, you know. I went jogging one day, right? And I realized I had drifted over in the wrong neighborhood. <laughs> and I had on a red t-shirt, right? And people were honking. But I thought they was like, you in the wrong territory, but really they were saying you in traffic, jogging, and <laughs> it's crazy.